I'm going to demonstrate for you how to properly use your Boston shaker as well as build a cocktail. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and build a cocktail called the Appleton Tang. First thing is you want to start by using uh, agave nectar for your sweet. Next you want to use a little bit of lime juice for the sour. And then for the strong, we're going to use Appleton Estate Reserve. And then we add ice. And now when you're properly using your Boston shaker, you want to take your tin portion and you want to place it on the top. Give it a little bit of a tap just to make sure the seal happens. Pick it up, make sure that the seal is there, nothing's falling. If it does, it's the wrong tool. So go ahead and move it around a little bit, just make sure that that seal is happening. Give it a little tap, and then you want to turn it over and make sure the glass portion is facing you. Turn to the side, give it a nice shake. The reason for this is you want to make sure you get a, some water and you want some dilution in order to balance out all of those kind of intense and delicious ingredients. Next, we're going to teach you how to, how to break the Boston shaker, how to, how to open it up. So what you need to do is you take two fingers and put it on the glass portion, two fingers put it on the tin portion, and you take the heel of your palm, and you want to just tap the, the top lip of the tin portion and just break that vacuum seal. If it doesn't happen the first time, just spin it again, hit it again. Ultimately, it will come apart just like this. Then you want to grab your Hawthorne strainer and a glass, already prepped with ice so it's nice and cold. Pour over the top of fresh ice. Add some grapefruit soda. Take your bar spoon, give it a nice little fold, making sure the drink is nice and consistent all the way through. And you want to take your grapefruit peel, give it a nice zest over the top, and then place it right inside the cocktail. That's the Appleton Ting.